this is the first tank that I bought, but the last tank that I set up, it has blue shrimp in it. And it's the least uh, decorated, but I still love it and the shrimp really love it. It just has plain sand substrate. This one has the driftwood that was a long piece that I cut up into pieces. And it just has a mix of shrimp in it. This one is my first one that I was really proud of that I set up. It's got mando in it and blue shrimp. One of them was expecting. This one's got my reds in it. I've always enjoyed this one. And this one here has my, what's supposed to be green jade. And they, uh, they don't look very green. They're dark, 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 dark green. And this is them eating a piece of a cucumber that I put in there last night. They've really been enjoying the cucumber and I've been enjoying them. There's not very many shrimp in this tank because a lot of them died. Apparently my tank wasn't cycled good enough. This one is my bottle tank and I have yellows. There's not very many yellows in there, but I have the mystery snails. It's doing really well. It's got bamboo growing out of the top with the ivy or pothos. And that's a Easter lily in pothos. It looked like a snail, but it was really just a big bubble. And uh, see, uh, what am I showing you here? Just a, just another green jade that I want to see. Look at those roots coming out. And that's just an ivy, pothos, pathos, whatever you call it. Up top, same thing. They're just growing like crazy. I've had them in there two or three weeks just from a plant that I bought at Walmart and took part. Got some ram horn snails in there now. That's uh, those are sort of uh, blue and pink. I've got uh, some in this tank and some in another tank. I'm gonna start breeding those. That's a piece of cedar in there with Mando. All of this wood came from a friend of mine, Jeremy Crowder. He's got a YouTube channel called Whole Nother Level Outdoors. And I appreciate him getting me this wood. All of this wood came either from the Arkansas River or a lake that's over by Rosebud, Arkansas. And it's just made all the difference. It, it's a, uh, there, there's the pieces that I've got coming up like stumps, but it's just made all the difference in these tanks. It's, they're very beautiful and the bacteria and the good stuff sticks to it the shrimp eat it off and they love it so i'm very very grateful for all of the driftwood that he's given me from here in arkansas and it, if i would have bought all of it you know it, it probably all this driftwood that he's given me is probably worth fifty dollars so thanks jeremy